Welcome to Big Lake Show Vibes. I am your host, Crim Slim, waiting on that next Lakers win. And we had to get it against them boys, the Rockets. You know, this was get back season. It did us dirty the last time when we said we was not having that. Dylan Brooks tried. He got sunned. Uh, I didn't even, did, did, I didn't see the twin playing. You know, you got, um, they ain't really got much. You know what I'm saying? This is a bunch of young, scrappy players. But we won 105, 104. Before we get started and talking about it, recently, as you know, we've been doing videos. This is just a little comedy. At, I don't know if it was at halftime, third quarter, whatever, they do this half court shot thing. You miss the half court shot. You get a three-point shot. Let's watch our guy make his attempt. $55,000. That's what he does. You heard him. Everybody, let's cheer on Anthony. <laughs> let's cheer on Anthony. Look at this clown. Bro, Anthony is hurt. Everybody put your hands together. Anthony calf, Anthony ankle, Anthony Achilles. We're not gonna have him. <laughs> so hurt. So let's put our hands together for the attack. It's over. Oh my goodness, that drum was hilarious. Oh, Anthony Davis is going to the free throw line. Everybody put your hands together for the attack. Let's put our 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 hands together for the attack. A solid game. Another amazing game for LeBron James. Listen, if you're new to the channel, like, comment, subscribe. We rocking after every single game. <sighs> Usually how we do this, three things we're going to talk about. A little baby rant. We're going to get into the box score and look at a little highlights. And then we're going to talk about who we got next. Top three takeaways. Number one, LeBron go James. I mean, the man just continues to give you uh, virtuoso, as Shannon Sharp would say. 37 points for a season high. Two of five from the three. This is just what I remember off the top of my head. I think it's like 14 for 19. Just super efficient. His son was in the building. Bronny was in the building. And he was just kicking ass and taking names. Had a little thing with Dylan Brooks, got a tech for giving him one of the bang bangs, you know what I mean? Gave him a little a little shoulder shiv. But it was a vibe. It was a vibe. And he just continues to show the age thing is it's just not an issue. It's not. He's my age, 38. And I'm telling you, it's not normal. <laughs> it's not. You can't be falling all on the ground and getting back up and continuing at this age. Like, you need a break. You're still young, but you're not young. It's a big difference. Now, that's point one. There's nothing much to keep saying. LeBron is LeBron. He's on his way to 39,000 points. And he should hit 40,000 within this season. So he's on just doing just, just LeBron things. But... The person who isn't always consistent that we need to give some credit to is Anthony Davis. Yes, he did foul out, but he's con but he stepped it up today. Let's give it to him. 27 points, I believe, uh, 10 boards. We could lose a little bit more on the boards, but his motor was up. His motor was up. And I see we need to feed him. That's just the thing, like Sangoon. Come on, you're supposed to be busting Sangoon's ass every single play, pause. Like, you just need to be doing that. So, maybe we shouldn't give him so much credit for this game, but he did what he needed to do. And as the big two, 
he did his contribution. Now, if you had to mention a big three, and this is point three, if you had to mention a big three when they took the pictures, it's not necessarily a big three. It's just our top three guys just happens to be, some would say, AR-15. And tonight, AR-15 let that thing off. <laughs> like, the man was out here hitting shots from half court damn near. I'm talking about from 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 Lakers logo from the, from this little spot right here. It's one of those like no 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 yes 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 oh okay it's okay. I'm like I don't know if I like that shot. I don't know if I like that shot, but I do like it. So it's just one of those things like AR-15. If you could give us. Consistently that 50, 40, 90, that's all we asking. I know it's a lot. But that's what we asking for me. Efficient basketball, timely buckets, and in the clutch time, we know we can count on you. You give us that, hey, you get that re up. Now, those three things aside, let's talk about. The team as a whole. Let's get to the box score. Otherwise, Darvin Ham, I, I just want to see more tall ball. Like, that's the only gripe. I just want to see more tall ball. Outside of that, everything is good. Everything is rocking. You can tell LeBron's too, like, player coach. Let's uh, mute this. All right. Now, let's get into the box score. All right, what we got going on? 105, 104, first quarter. Didn't lose by, we were, we were down by 10 in the first quarter, but we weren't down by 10 at the end of the first quarter. I, that's all I'm concerned with. Down by eight, but that's fine. 28, 20, second quarter, took the uh, bounce back a little bit. 29, 27, was still down at the half, going into the half. Third quarter, we came out looking like, it's time to just shut these boys out. 32 to 20, third quarter for the Lake Show. Pretty much put things out of hand. And the fourth quarter was a cruise control, 29-24 for the Rockets. They tried to fight back. Almost made it happen. But they came up short. And usually, we're the team that's fighting on the way up. It's like two sides of the coin. One side is the team that's fighting, fighting to get back. And the other team is fighting to keep the other team down. Like, this is one of those. We got to fight to keep this team down. They was trying, but they couldn't make it happen. So shout out to us. Shout out to us. That's definitely not one of those areas that we're good at. As a team, 41% from the field, 21% from the three, 72% from the free throw line, 21 of 29. We took 29 three-pointers, only hit six. I don't like that number. If we hit six, but we take 21, 22, I like that a way better. That just means that we weren't driving to the paint as much as we should. Pump fakes, get to the rack. 17 turnovers, mm, it's a lot, but we did cause 18. 26 assists is close to our number, but they had 35. You can tell they were playing just better ball than us. Won the rebounding battle, 42 to 34, and 10 on offensive rebounds to that six. Rare occasion. Shout out to uh, everybody I seen was getting rebounds. Brian got some, AD got some. I seen AR grabbing. You know what I'm saying? So everybody contributed on that. And one thing I will notice about the rebounds, AD made it a case to be the one that boxes out. And let one of our guards grab a rebound. I seen D Lo catch a couple boards off it, off that kind of energy. One block for us. That's uncharacteristic because AD gonna give you like four or five of them things. 13 steals. Cam, shout out to you, bruh. You can you just continue in that. 13 personal fouls. That's great defense. Alright. Now let's get to the main to the main course. The players. Goat James led the team in minutes at 40. 
37 points, 6 rebounds, 8 assists, 14 and 19 from the field, 2 of 5 from the 3, 7 and 9 from the free throw line, and gave us 3 steals. AD, 27 points, 10 rebounds, 3 assists, 11 of 15 from the field. The two stars were just efficient today. Didn't take a 3, 5 of 7 from the free throw line, 1 block, 2 steals. If we was going to get a block, it was going to be from AD. That's just how it goes. D-Lo, oh, no, I'm sorry, Cam Reddish playing the second most minutes on the team behind LeBron James and way ahead of AD. LeBron 40 minutes, Cam 39, AD next with 33. So again, Cam Reddish, 39 minutes, 7 points, 3 rebounds, 3 assists, 3 of 9 from the field, 1 of 5 from the 3, that's okay. Gave us 3 steals as well. The man is still in the... Yo. He might get arrested for how much theft has been going on. I'm telling you, like, grand larceny, all right? He's scam reddish. The man is a thief. The man is a thief, all right? He's a hustler and he's a thief. Scam reddish is his new nickname. D-Lo. Regression game. Regression game. You, it's okay. It's okay. You don't got to be nice every night, but damn. Four points, five rebounds, two assists, one of eight from the field, one of five from the three, one of two from the free throw line. Did give us three steals as well. Shout out to him. Prince. You're bugging now. D-Lo will give it a pass because D-Lo has given us 20 points a night on multiple occasions. Two points, four rebounds, two assists, one of 11 from the field, 0 of four from the three, 0 of one from the free throw line. Yeah, don't do that again. Don't do that again. That's all I'm going to say on that one. Just don't do it. Like, you, you, you're bugging. Oh, yeah, we in the third quarter. Okay. It's a battle right here. It's a battle, but we about to assert our dominance. On deep, um, from the bench, Rui got some decent minutes, 32 minutes, 11 points, four rebounds, two assists, four of 10 from the field, 0 of four from the three, three of four from the free throw line. I see he was playing with LeBron and AD tonight as opposed to replacing LeBron. And, the, and for what it's worth, that lineup did well. It also did have Scam Reddish in there and AR-15 and AD. So there's that, but the lineup did well. Speaking of AR-15, 17 points, 6 rebounds, 6 assists, 5 of 7 from the field, 2 of 5 from the, I mean, 2 of 3 from the 3, 5 of 6 from the free throw line. That's all we're asking for. Efficient basketball. I like even seeing you do the pump fake in the lane, get the AM1. It's AR-15 and the A is for AN-1. Come on, man. Christian Wood, 18 minutes, 2 rebounds, 0-4 from the field, 0-3 from the 3. I like seeing you as a big man, not as the perimeter guy no more. I see, once I see it, I'm like, this is way better. Yeah, you can have a random one-off, catch it to 3, whatever. But you need to be under the rim, put work in. Jackson Hayes, five minutes, two rebounds, didn't get a shot off. And that's all who got burned. Shout out to Max, man. Don't worry, your time is coming. What a game. What a game. It's something about this season. The games are exciting. The games are amazing. Games are interesting. Oh, wait. Oh, you, you see. The game is just at gold is closing. Fourth quarter, Brian is still phenomenal. I'm sure he's back to nine points, nine to ten points a game and just in the fourth quarter. So uh, let's sit back. There's a couple moments left. Let's uh, turn this up and listen. Here we go. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah. Get him, Goat. Oh, nice pass. Yeah, hey, that's what I'm talking about. D-A-R. Deep AR bomb. Deep AR bomb. That's okay. That's okay. 
That's all right. Let's go. Yeah, Brian was like, I'm not taking this free throw. You bugging. Come on, AR. Get that. We went one for two. That's okay. Uh, hey, Brian, that's no foul. I like that. That's the best you can do. Mm, why do they have to show that? It's supposed to be a highlights. It's game winning free throw, though. That's all you need to know. Clanked it. Yeah. Yeah. And that's, you know what I'm saying? That's all she wrote. So, right now the Lakers are eight and six. We're running, we're doing our thing. You know, it, it's it's a good feeling to be up. I think maybe last season, just right until the very end, we weren't over 500 the entire season. It was just playing catch up. So it feels, I'm, I'm talking about extremely good to be two games up over 500 and the opportunity to get on a real run. You know what I'm saying? Get on a real run. We got play, I mean, not playing, I keep saying it. We got in season 20 coming up. But first, let's get a thumbnail on these clowns. The Houston Rockets. Oh, let me get, let me get back up. Let me get back on that. All right. <laughs> All right. Now let's get to the next game that we got. <clears throat> oh, I know it's Tuesday. We got back to back games Tuesday and Wednesday. Let's get to it. Twenty first in season tournament. This solidifies us. If we get the W, we got home court advantage in the quarterfinals. That's what they keep saying. I don't really know how deep that means, but we got it right. Second of all, if we lose, we can still get in by way of um, wild card. You know what I'm saying? Because we've been putting work in. So it's really going to be an interesting matchup. The, the ball is in our court. We just got to put hands on them. Uh, I think we're at L.A., Jazz at Lakers. Yeah, we in L.A., okay? And the boys play well. D'Lo plays well at home, like he does. And the court, court is not bad. I kind of like the court, you know what I'm saying? So it's going to be a vibe. Let's see who we got missing from these. Let's see who's, if there's going to be any kind of... Uh, Fockery going on. Utah right now, though. Four and nine on the season. Yeah, yeah. We need to smoke them. That's just what we need to do. Right now, they only got Kessler out. We got Gabe Vincent out, Vando out still. James day to day with the calf. AD day to day with the abductor, the hip. And Hood Shafino out day to day with the knee. He wasn't getting much burn this season. He was with he was rocking with Max. And that's pretty much wraps it up. Hope y'all enjoyed this, man. I hope y'all enjoying this ride. It's a much better start to the season than we came out two and ten. And it, it, trust me, just because they say the number two and ten doesn't mean we went on a ten game winning streak and got things back in hand. No. It, it, it continued to falter. Right up until the very end. So let's just keep stacking these wins. Let's just keep doing what we do. We done already slayed a couple giants. We done got two dubs on um, Phoenix Suns. We got a dub over the uh, the Clippers. Like, this is that year. This is that year. We need to see the Denver Nuggets next, though. We need to see them coming up soon and give them a spanking. Then we need to make it. I think we got an East Coast run too. Let's just check the schedule. Let's see who we got before we run out. We still got a couple more seconds. I try to keep it at twenty minutes. Who do we have coming up? I know we got an East Coast run. We got the Jazz on Tuesday, Mavericks on Wednesday, 
Saturday is the Cavs. Monday is Philly. Wednesday is the Pistons. Thursday is the Thunder. What's up with these back-to-backs? And then Saturday, December, and, and that closes us out for the month. We'll just talk about the rest of the month. Two back-to-backs. I get it Tuesday, Wednesday, Thanksgiving, Thursday, you know, Black Friday, Friday, chilling, you know what I'm saying? And then Saturday, they back in action. Okay, cool. All right. Well, that's about it. We will see you in season tournament style on Tuesday. Hopefully, the jersey will be in on Wednesday. But we'll see. I'll holla at y'all. We already got the thumbnail, so we are out.